Sometimes when you install Linux, you install with the minimal instead of the GNOME desktop, and you really want the GNOME desktop, but you've made a mistake and you have forgotten to install it. If that's the situation you're in, and you have networking, you can upgrade. So first, I'm going to log in as root. And you can install the graphical desktop, the GNOME desktop, using the yum command. So yum minus y group install. Group install will get a whole bunch of packages. And you do the GNOME desktop. Now, the GNOME desktop has many, many packages involved in it. And so when you do this group install, it will download all these packages, install them, but it won't switch your system to booting by default from the GNOME desktop to the GNOME desktop. It will actually stay in its multi-user target mode until you are ready to switch to desktop mode. So let's go ahead and skip ahead a bit. Okay, a couple of minutes have passed and all of the installation, downloading installation, uh, cleanup and verification has all happened and now I'm ready to continue. The next big thing I need to do is I need to configure it to change the default environment. So I can use system CTL set default and normally it's a um, multi-user dot target, but I'm not going to be using that. I want to use the GUI. So I change that to graphical target. And that changes it to be the default of a graphical target. And at this point I can just type reboot and reboot into my new system, or I could try going directly into the graphical system by using system CTL isolate graphical target, which should take me into my GUI. And now that I have this taken care of, um, it asks me first to accept the license because I didn't do that during installation or after the installation. So I can uh, see continue and it wants me to um, one for completely their license. Um, if I want to accept it, I can press two to accept the license and then I can continue and then it wants me to continue again. And finally, it gets to the other things I should have gotten to during the graphical install. And I have my account right there. And that is switching to a graphical GNOME desktop from the minimal installation.